What is happening y'all? Alexander with Guns.com and I kind of have a dream job and for me it's just another day in paradise at Guns.com. So we are going to take a look at some of the cool, unique, and historical firearms that we get through our We Buy Guns program. It's one of my favorite parts of the day, one of the best parts of the job. And today we have a Bushmaster arm pistol, which is one of the original firearms that got Bushmaster up and going. So let's dig into the history, the functionality, and what makes it so unique. We have one of the original kind of AR style pistols. Right here is the Bushmaster arm pistol. A little bit of history behind this is dating back to 1972. This firearm was introduced by the Gwynn Firearms Company. Bushmaster bought out the Gwynn Firearms Company in 1973, and this arm pistol remained in production all the way up until 1988. Uh, it's kind of based loosely off of the AR-15 and also the AK. It has a long stroke gas piston similar to that of the AK. However, the bolt is the same rotating uh, bolt design that comes from the uh, 1941 Johnson rifle, which eventually found its way into the design of the AR-15. Interestingly enough, this is kind of the pistol version of a compact carbine that Bushmaster made throughout the 70s and 80s, all the way up until, I believe, 1990. Um, and it, like I said, it's, it's one of the original like AR pistols, and AR pistols are extremely prominent. It's kind of a hot topic now. Uh, and this is very rudimentary, um, being kind of the beginning and the start. But we'll go over some of the things that make this unique. First of all, uh, the design is called the arm pistol because it's made to be tucked up against your arm, kind of pressed up against your bicep when you shoot it. One of the weird kind of aspects of this gun is the way that the upper and lower rotates. If you'll notice here, the gun feeds off of standard 30 round 5.56 magazines and uh, the charging handle is right here. You can pull back on that and see that long stroke gas piston right there that goes up through the gas tube. The firearm ejects from the top. So when you're ready to fire, you would take this magazine, insert it into the gun. You would pull back, charge the firearm, then you would rotate the magazine or the upper to either go if you're a right-handed shooter, then it would kind of go this way. If you were a left-handed shooter, you would rotate it the other way. And it's just designed to kind of be tucked into your arm and kind of grab on with it with both hands. The sights also rotate. Uh, so if you were to shoot it, you could actually extend your arms, kind of shoot it like a, like a handgun. Kind of tuck it in and then let her rip. Like I said, it's a very rudimentary design. Uh, interestingly enough, there's like a trigger reset uh, kind of disconnect. So the gun either has to be locked to one side or the other or locked in the middle, kind of in that traditional orientation. Outside of that, uh, it, I did get a little bit of time to shoot the firearm. I uh, got through a couple of magazines and I will say it's a little violent. That long stroke gas piston has a lot of recoil. It's a little bit of a wild ride when you tuck in. It feels really awkward and it's very weird. Uh, I'm not saying that this is the best gun that's ever been invented or the best pistol that's ever been invented, but that original kind of OG nature of the AR pistol, this being one of the first products that Bushmaster brought to market, which put Bushmaster on the map, uh, as well as just the weird and stupid design that it is. Uh, it's just an amazing thing to get to see something that you don't necessarily run into at your local gun shops, not something you even see online. It's more often found in places like auction houses or YouTube videos, but uh, I think it's unique, something great that you can add to the collection. It's a piece of especially civilian firearms history. Being a pistol, it kind of falls into a different category, and uh, there's a lot of differences and 
legislation and a lot of discussions that are going on around things like AR pistols. And it's great to get an opportunity to see where a lot of this kind of dates back to and how rudimentary the entire concept kind of started. We here at guns.com don't just sell firearms, but we also buy firearms. There are so many amazing things that we get through our We Buy Guns program, things that are unique, crazy, and stuff that you're not gonna see at your local gun shop. Thank you so much for taking a little bit of time today to look at our Bushmaster arm pistol. As always, we're trying to be your one-stop shop for all your firearms needs. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe.